this is a quite special thing. I think uh, in Chinese uh, culture. Uh, but uh, I, when I met uh, quite some uh, a lot of foreign people, I uh, also realize in Western culture also talk some about the heart connect with our mind. Uh, for English, the warm heart means your mind, uh, your mind <laughs> positive. Uh, uh, and nourish other people warm, you are warm. Uh, uh, you, like uh, the sentence say, hurt my heart, or from bottom of my heart. Uh, actually, you know, the English was original, the heart is a physical heart, but they use this word in spiritual, in the mental state, uh, uh, from my inner perception psychology the psychology of inner perception uh, already right and uh, some study deeper study research about this uh, just because of the heart heart working by electricity the watt is a uh, 1.7 watt the brain uh, also Brain nerves was also working by electricity, but the the the, the, the electricity wave much lower, uh, fifty or sixty times different. Yeah, uh, and uh, here the, the the scientists the, the researcher they found the heart, the energy field or can be say chi field, much bigger than than the your brain the. The, the electricity, the energy field. They give a figure like 2,000 times more uh, bigger than the brain field, the electricity field, uh, or magnetic force, such as kind of field, phys phys physics field. Uh, so if uh, by this way, you know, your heart influences your mind, it's possible. Uh, so in Chinese culture, we always say your heart control your thinking. In the hospital, some people after the heart transplant, uh, people realize there are a lot of uh, this kind of patient after the heart transplant, other people's heart, uh, their mind, their character, their thinking, their style. Someone totally change. Mm -hmm. That also shows uh, your heart really influences your mind. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.